Hi, this is Graham from Cobweb Solutions, and I'm going to walk you through one of our Power BI showcase reports. What we have here is a very basic looking customer services dashboard, and this is deliberately basic. I've been building reports and dashboards for many years now, and there's always a temptation to throw everything at the wall and see what sticks, in terms of what data you choose and how you choose to visualize it. But if you want a report that's truly meaningful, it's important to focus on a handful of metrics that really matter to you and which you can use to make decisions and drive change within your business. In this instance, we're looking at case management information from a customer services team. And what really matters to them is the total number of cases being raised, how these cases are dealt with in terms of whether the case was resolved with an SLA, the overall time to reduce resolve the case, and whether the case was resolved with the first attempt, the first time fix. As well, of course, as overall customer satisfaction. So here in the top left, we can see the overall trending for the number of cases segregated by month and by severity of that case, along with the overall first time fixed percentage for these cases. Next to this, we can see the first time fixed percentage ranked by agent. And this gives us an instant view of which agents are resolving cases at the first attempt. Along the bottom, we can see metrics for the overall total number of cases being raised, the average resolution time, percentages rate resolved within SLE, and the percentages of first time fix, as well, of course, as the overall customer satisfaction. And this covers the top level metrics that a customer services manager might be interested in. But where Power BI helps us to understand this information better is that it easily allows us to slice and dice between these metrics. So if I want to look at an individual agent's metrics, I can simply click on that agent. And we'll, here we'll see that the agent, Emily Davies, has a higher than average customer satisfaction percentage, as well as a higher than average first time fix percentage. We can also see that all the charts and all the metrics here are sliced to show just the results for Emily. We can also drill down further into Emily's stats by maybe only looking at her severity three cases. And again, we'll see that all the charts and all the visualizations refresh again, so we just see Emily's severity three cases. Likewise, we could do this for any agent in any metric to drill down into real depth for each report. This data is summarized on a monthly basis, but it's just as easy to create views on the same data for a daily, weekly, or any other period. So from a relatively simple looking dashboard, the customer service manager or anybody else that's interested in this data is able to gain real insights as to the performance of the department, as well as individual agents. If you want to find out more, please contact us using the details on screen now. Thank you for your time.